So welcome back to Set the Tally Films. I'm your host, Coach Evans, and I appreciate you guys for hanging with me. Had a little break, had to take care of some business, but we're back. Uh, today we're going to kick off, well not kick off, we're going to continue our study of, it started with the More Proche, Less Record video, or Less Record, More Proche, however I named it. It started with that. And what I did was I charted the plays and noticed the difference in the plays per, the yards per play with with Ricard in versus the yards per play without him in. And so um, we didn't, we did we had one other chance to do well that was the last game of the season so i didn't really have another chance to do that because at the end of the year he went on he was hurt so i decided to just go back to the beginning of the season and see how those numbers averaged out and uh this video won't last long we're gonna go through the list and you, the results are gonna speak for himself because it's crazy it's crazy this is from the raiders game and so you know i'll do a game a day or every other day until i get to Every game they record play, and then I'll try to compile the numbers together. But this is from the Raiders game, and let me get to that. All right. You see on the screen you have um, the play number, like the offensive play number, and then the first column, which is this column here, if it'll light up. This column here is with record in the game, so that's why I say it's 42. This column here is with no record in the game. That's why I say it's no 42. Obviously, his number is 42. So, and each time the color shifts, like right here, you see all yellow. This is a drive within itself. Then it changed to green. This is a second drive. And if I'm not mistaken, I wrote out TDs on plays that ended up being TDs. So you'll see the first drive. He was in there for two plays, a uh, total of 20 yards, which is a nice nice round number for him. That's 10 yards a play. Uh, you jump down to the second drive. He was in there for a play of 21, a play of 35, a play of three, and a play of zero. And uh, we got a touchdown on a play he was in. So that's a lot. That's what? One, two, three, four, five. That's six plays on the first 14 plays. Uh, come down to our third drive. We had a three and out. Uh, the one play he was in, we got minus three. Our fourth drive, he's in there for a play of 29, minus four, zero, and four. Then we got a 10-yard touch, touchdown. I don't remember who that touchdown was. We our next drive, and he pretty much dominated as far as being in the game the next drive. One, then he was out. 16, three, four, two, zero. Um, I think we got stopped on fourth down. I think this is Latavius Murray. We got stopped on fourth down this play. Uh, the next drive, two of the five plays, uh, ten yard pass to somebody. Then he was out for incomplete pass. Four yard run. Then he was out for the next two incomplete passes. Next drive, he's in for pretty much half of it. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. So a little bit more than half of this next drive, and with the big play being fifteen. And we got a minus six, which I think ended up being a sack or something on fourth down. Come down to this next drive. He What's in red is him actually touching the ball. So you'll see on this drive, he had a catch for six yards. And he's in for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of these nine plays. He's in the game. And he actually touched the ball for six yards. Next drive, he touched it again for nine yards. So he's actually running routes, getting the ball, you know, in this game. Um, he's in for every play but one. The one play he's out, we got a 28-yard gain. And then the very last drive, he was in for two of the five plays. Now, this number is what shocked the, the heck out of me. So let's let's do this column first. It's, and if, I, if you remember correctly, the first game I did, I don't remember who it was, but it was drastically in favor of him being out of the game, the numbers. And obviously, I'm kind of giving away where we're going with this. It's def it changed this game. And this is the first game of the season, which I can see why Roman maybe used him a lot. He played 60% of these plays. Out of these 66 plays, he played 60% of these plays, and I, I had the number. I wrote the number down when I was doing the research earlier today, but I don't have it in front of me, but I know it came out to be 60% of the plays. So with Ricard out of the game, we averaged 4.6 yards per play. 4.6 yards per play. Let's see with him in the game. This game. Just this one. Not totally. Just this game versus the Raiders. Seven point one five. 
which is crazy. It's a total reverse from the last game I did. Total reverse. Maybe not exactly the numbers wise, but it was a, a clear shift in the the first game that I did that we were better with record out. This game, he played 60% of the plays, and we were clearly better with him in there. So this is going to be an interesting study as I go through the games to see how that evens out. So, I mean, technically, if we're going to go one for one, you know, game for game is one game he was good, we were better with him in, and one game we were worse with him in. So this is going to be an interesting study to see, and I just you know, want to bring this to you. Uh, the next game I'll do will probably be the second game, whoever we play second, I don't remember. And um, we're going to keep this thing rolling, man. Uh, so I appreciate you guys for coming through. If you like this content, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share your thoughts about you know this type of content and the actual results of this chart and your thoughts about Ricard staying or re-signing or if you want them out of here. I uh, appreciate you guys for being here. You could have been anywhere in the world, but you chose to be here with me. Coach Evans, out. Peace. With the, with the, with the, with the.